I hope so. I mean, <laughs> the p people pass me the ball, so, you know, I'm just trying to make shots. But, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, coach, uh, coach keeps telling me to shoot when I'm open, and uh, my teammates do too. So, you know, when they're doubling down on Vlad and Lumpkins and uh, they, you know, they kick it out to me, you know, it's my job to shoot it. So that's what I do. I shoot it. Let it go. <laughs> I feel like since uh, the first Lehigh game, they've been playing with the same. Probably that game, it was just it was probably a lot more one-on-one -on -one in the post, not so much doubling. But since then, they've been doubling in the post. It's hard to catch the ball in the post. You know, I don't have that much room. But uh, I think that I got used to it. The coaches got used to it, and uh, most importantly, my teammates got used to it. You know, I feel like we know what to do in those situations. Uh, yeah, they they definitely came out a little hard in the second half. I would say, you know, that's that's basically like their mantra that they they play very hard and uh, you know they they uh, you know pressured us more on defense. Um, not to say that they didn't play hard in the first half, but you know, uh, yeah, they definitely came out a little hard in the second half. I would say. Um, you know, that win in this game was was big for for our team. Um, you know, after losing and particularly the way we lost at, at, at Colgate. Uh, when it seemed as if we, you know, we, we had the game and then it, we, we kind of let it slip through our fingers. Um, you know, I was, I was really concerned with, with the guys' uh, mental approach and, and I, I didn't want them getting down. And, and being the kind of team that we've been, um, you know, what we tried to emphasize is just, just keep hanging in there, keep plugging, keep staying together. You know, and, and, and you know, good things can happen. And obviously it did. It, it wasn't a great game on our part. I thought it was a pretty daggone good effort. Um, it, it really it, it wasn't a play. It was Danny made the play. Um, basically what we did is we wanted to make sure against their pressure that we inbounded the ball and if they were going to foul, you know, we had certain guys uh, re receiving the ball. They elected not, not to foul. There was about an 18 second differential, I, I think. Um, but, you know, they were extending their defense. There were driving lanes there. Um, it, it took some guts for Danny because he had made some, some miscues, a couple defensively and, and, and maybe one uh, a, a couple possessions before. So, you know, he, he I thought, showed some, some confidence to, to drive the ball in there. And with the floor spread the way it was, um, you know, he had, he had room. And, and uh, I mean, he basically, uh, you know, just hand delivered it to, to Lump. Uh, all Lump had to do was lay it in. But that was an individual play. I and mean, that's what basketball players do. That had nothing to do with coaching. Um, you know, Danny just made a really nice play. Uh, I think in a couple big threes, two free throws uh, at the end. Uh, what can you say about his response and difficulties it's going to have in this season? You know, it, it was a, a solid effort on Nick's part. Um, you know, um, he, he was trying to uh, you know, make some, some plays during the course of the game. You know, Army, they're a physical team in, in a different way than, say, a Holy Cross is. But, you know, when you drive the ball, they, they swarm you, and a lot of slapping and reaching. And, you know, that can result, you know, in, in a, a fair amount of turnovers. Um, but he was one, one guy that was willing to at least try to make those plays. And there were a couple that I thought, you know, I, I wasn't excited about, um, but, uh, you know, you, you have to try to make some plays, and you can't just go out there and just pass it around. You know, you, you, um, so I, I thought he was a guy that did that. But certainly, uh, his his free throws were were real big uh, down the stretch. I mean, Simon just plugs away. I mean, he's he he's a blue collar guy. He doesn't do anything spectacular. He doesn't do anything great. He's just you know he's always there defensively. He's trying to do, you know, trying to do what we ask him to do. Trying to make it, uh, the the guy he's matched with uh, have to work. Um, he's 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 not afraid to stick his nose, uh, you know, in in in, uh, in traffic. Um, and uh, you know, those are the kind of guys that, that you need. Um, He's not going to win any uh, three-point shooting contests or anything like that, but he helps our, our team be better.